a chapter a day to brighten your way. Let's be more proactive when it comes to love. Hello, friends. Let us read the Bible together. Today we'll be reading Psalms chapter 13. Faced with Saul's relentless pursuit, David spent eight or nine years on the run. It is difficult for an average person to truly imagine this experience. When the days of hiding, fighting, and killing seemed never-ending, David lamented to God. He once even wondered whether God had forgotten about him. Let's read chapter 13 together. Psalm 13 To the Choir Master, a Psalm of David How long, O Lord, will you forget me forever? How long will you hide your face from me? How long must I take counsel in my soul and have sorrow in my heart all the day? How long shall my enemy be exalted over me? Consider and answer me, O Lord my God. Light up my eyes, lest I sleep the sleep of death. Lest my enemies say, I have prevailed over him. Lest my foes rejoice because I am shaken. But I have trusted in your steadfast love. My heart shall rejoice in your salvation. I will sing to the Lord because he has dealt bountifully with me. If we look closely, we can see that David's mood dramatically changed in these six short verses. He first sighed in despair, then decided to commit himself to God with active prayer. In the end, David confidently looked forward to God's abundant grace. Dear friends, Perhaps you have also been in a difficult situation where you wondered whether God had left you and forgotten about you. Let's think about it from a different perspective and take the initiative to approach God. May you have David's faith and hope to never stop praying and relying on God. May your heart be glad because of God's saving grace. Let's pray. Dear Jesus, instead of only looking at my own difficulties, I want to take the initiative to approach you. Please hear my prayers and strengthen my faith, for you are my eternal hope. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. A chapter a day to brighten your way. See you tomorrow. Jesus loves you, and I love you too.